you guys doing? Tim Chapman, also known as Mr. Customer Service on eBay. And I have a new question. Somebody asked, hey, Tim, uh, do you use any special listing program or anything on eBay? And I go, well, as a matter of fact, I do. And the program I use is called Six Fit Software. Uh, first it was Seller's Assistant, and then it was Blackthorn, and now it's um, Six Fit Software. It's kind of an evolution, the same guy does them. And uh, the main reason uh, that I use this program is that you're able to put cost into the listing. So what happens when you put your cost in um, at the end of the year when you're doing your taxes or you want to do it monthly, whatever you want, you can just print out a profit loss statement. It pulls all the information from all the costs from eBay and from PayPal and it pulls all, in for all that information and puts it into the program and you can see your profit loss. It doesn't pull from stamps.com stamps though, and I use a lot of stamps.com because it's really fast. Uh, but very powerful program. It's a desktop type program, so it's on your desktop, it's not on the internet. And you can put all of your templates in there and all your costs. You have a whole load of templates, like I have, you know, I do a lot of books and I do um, scuba stuff and knives and non-kitchen knives and all these things, the collectibles, you put all these templates all separate and you just, you enter the title, enter the price, enter the description, and then run through and put the shipping in and then you go to the next one. So very, very fast, very powerful program. So that's what I, I would suggest. It's a little expensive because it's like 30 bucks a month. But for me, I'm full time that, and of course it's right off, but it's a really powerful program. It keeps all the information for you works really good so the uh, home run of the week well, it's not of the week actually like most of them haven't been but uh and it's kind of ebay uh, off ebay and uh, the story goes this is about mm, six months now uh some friends of mine they actually do estate sales so they go and they run estate sales you know they go to estate sales sometimes but mostly they run them they went to this estate and they um they looked at the state. It really wasn't very good. Didn't have very much stuff. But there was one painting on the wall. And he goes, well, I really don't want to do the estate, but I, I'm interested in that painting right there on the wall. And the guy goes, nah, you either have to do the whole thing. So they wanted the painting, so they bought the whole estate. They bought the estate out for $8,000. And when they do the estate, they'll get their $8,000 back, and they're probably not going to make very much on that. But they took the painting. His wife did some research on the painting and they go well, you know what i think this is a good painting so they didn't put it on ebay they sent it to sotheby's in new york or wherever back there and they put it up at auction you know they put it on the magazine and list and put it out there so like i said they bought the estate for eight thousand dollars they'll get three thousand dollars back um so they sent the, the painting to sotheby's sold for a hundred and seventy five thousand dollars so never, nevertheless, I'm buying paintings now. I have three or four paintings up. Not, nothing big like that. I, I'll buy, you know, I bought some paintings for, last week I bought them for, you know, like $75 each. And I'll more than double on each of those. But it's okay, but it's a start. You might run into a good one sometimes. So uh, that's a pretty good story for you. So that's uh, Home Run of the Week. We'll talk to you next time. Have a good day.